It happened one night last week, and to some, the jeers and boos directed at the Maple Leafs sounded like curses in a cathedral. Never had morale sunk so low. The fans disgusted, the players raw and frustrated. Even owner Harold Ballard joined the chorus. We haven't played very well. Matter of fact, we played lousy. And the sports commentators pulled out all the stops. If I have to sit through an entire winter of this, of this garbage with the Maple Leafs, I may lose my sanity and go off the deep end. Who could recall the last time fans marched in protest outside the gardens, symbolically tearing up tickets and urging people to stay away? Or when scalpers were offering red seats for a buck apiece for a midweek game and couldn't even give them away? What holds the Leafs together today is the memory of a better time, the early and mid-60s when the city cheered itself hoarse for its Stanley Cup champions. Hockey capital of the world. And we can prove it because we have the world's champions, the Maple Leafs. Those were the black and white days of greatness. Armstrong, Mahovlich, Bauer. When they didn't win the cup, they were at least contenders. The Leafs filled the gardens then, and it's a credit to the legend that they fill it today even with low-grade hockey like this. Officially, every home game since 1946 has been a sellout. Companies and individuals line up for blocks of seats. Even when the seats are empty, they're paid for. More than 15,000 seasons passes ranging in price from $250 to $800. King Clancy, the oldest Maple Leaf of all, calls it a matter of faith. The legend will be back. Uh, Maple Leafs, uh, uh, the Maple Leaf Hockey Club, have been champions and they will be champions again. Other voices, however, are harsher. I wouldn't give you a nickel for the hockey they play and I wouldn't give you five cents if they offered me free tickets to go to these games. But in the end, it's the only game in town and as Harold Ballard says, somewhat unkindly, we're not too fussy about where we spend our entertainment dollar. As you know, in this city, whether well, it's baseball, football, or ping pong, or jacks, you can always get a crowd.